Our servant service and electric athlete of the week is trying to win a state title this weekend. Adrian Lueveno introduces us to Skyline quarterback Cade Marlowe. We knew it was, we knew it was possible. Like it was, it's been a goal, goal of ours for this entire season, one of our main goals. And uh, man, it's just it's exciting to be here. Cade Marlowe's two touchdown performance helped Skyline advance to the 4A state championship game. His leadership under center is a big reason why the Grizzlies have been successful. You know, last winter I just said if you if you want to be the guy, you got to put in the time to, to to be the guy, and he he did that. And he's, you know, with this age group, he's always been their leader, and he's you know just done a good job of of stepping up this fall. Marlowe knows what it takes to win a state championship. He was a part of the 2017 state title team. In preparation, it's really we're prep preparing like we do for any other team. But the nerves, I feel like they're gonna they're gonna start picking up when when game time rolls around. So he got to see how special it was and and kind of how it was done. And you know he waited a long time to to have it be his chance. And and this year it's been his chance, and he's done a good job of, of stepping up and 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 making plays when he had to make plays. And he's a good leader for our team. All right, thanks, Adrian. The Grizzlies travel to the Treasure Valley to play Emmett on Saturday. Marlowe will get a plaque from Crown Trophy for his achievement. And if you have an Athlete of the Week recommendation, send us an email at sports at localnews8.com. It's exciting to see, you know, those awards that they're able to get and stuff like that. Like, I can't wait for my son to start playing sports so I can you know, cheer him on on the sidelines like that, so. Yeah, hopefully it's a little bit better better weather than yeah. the Grizzlies had to be in last Friday for that semifinal. I don't know if you caught some of those highlights, but that, uh, yeah. yeah. Uh, we're hoping for better weather this weekend for the championship games. So. Yeah, okay, keep our fingers crossed. All right, yeah. thank you so much, Dylan.